kid to just about everybody tonight. Got a chance to see Johnny Allstaff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> kind of nice to get a chance to get to see everybody and get them all out there in the midweek. When you win, yeah. yeah. Uh, I thought they did fine. You know, even the <laughs> kind of tells you how uh, we've been going. The one kid from Portland had his first at bat of the season, and it was a time when it was hard to see, and he looked like he was having a tough time seeing the ball. And, we threw a fastball down the middle, and you saw that one pretty good. He hit it out. So, good job by Roman all to at least throw a strike. I told him I'd rather see him excuse me, challenge the hitter than walk the guy there. Kind of everybody on the next four come in and throw hit list, and you get Kirk out there, and then Nuggets Mexican has got everybody to, to get out and loosen up. It's got a pretty good look to it. Warren, uh, Crook, and, and Nogo with those three arms. I thought we did fine. Uh, you know, set a little things that we did. A button run is an exciting offensive play, and we executed that really well with Graybeck and Kasser, and even later in the game it didn't work out, but Graybeck had a nice slash, and one of our ex-players Sapp was way in, and it went right at him, and that was a well-executed offensive play, and we had some good good sacrifice bunting uh, game, and you know, some, some set the table stuff, and we finally broke through with a huge hit by Packer. Hope was sort of a, a boost going into a big series this weekend? Well, we hope so. Yeah, you know, it'll be uh, Cal's playing awfully well. They've got good pitching, and uh, we need to get back on the winning track in, in the pack, you know, whether it's Cal or anybody else. So hopefully this is a start of something uh, that we can sustain. And, uh, let's start with two in a row right on Friday. <laughs> Packard talked about seeing some duck baseball and you get 10 runs and only two extra base hits. So you, know, so you had to manufacture some things like you were referring to. So did you feel like you, you guys were yourselves for, for well, You know, you know we, we get a kid that tries to advance on a ball in the dirt with two outs, which is not good baseball if you get thrown out. Uh, Grayback was overzealous on his extension. and uh, you know, I'd have to be honest, we, we don't want those to happen because we're not sitting there every inning but we got a second. And the, uh, the hits that have been elusive have been the two out hits. And, uh, that one inning, you know, a, wa a dose, a walk to drive in two runs, and then a big blow with Pack. Uh, Pack had an opportunity to have a, a, a bat in uh, Michigan that uh, didn't go so well for him, and he certainly looked like himself today, so good for him. You know, it looks like he will. He threw a bullpen today, and it was, uh, I'd be lying to you if I told you it, it was pain free and, and good. So that's the main thing. He'll throw another one on Friday if he passes that test, and we'll be able to use him in the game. It's too big, like you say. I mean, this series kind of sets up where they're at. You can kind of flip some things in your guys' favor with, with a good series. Well, yeah, you know, uh, who knows? So, you know, with them sweeping the Beavers, and the Beavers have really handled uh, the whole season extremely well. Uh, I think the league's still, you know, it's way too early to predict anything. You know, whether Utah's going to stay up there and Cal's going to stay up there. And some teams that are traditionally up there are not up there. And, and so, yeah, we want to certainly uh, do our part of that. And not fumble this weekend an opportunity to play well, and they go, gee, shucks, we had we done better. So certainly we didn't get off to the kind of start we wanted, but uh, I think the conference race is still out there for somebody, including us, if we start playing better baseball.